Hey, how y'all doing? I'm Joanne. Welcome back to my channel. This morning, while I'm still trying to wake up, like I'm like, why am I so sleepy? Like I went to bed like one, no, not one, 1225 a.m. And I didn't wake up until like 730. Like, why am I so tired? I don't really know. But I'm trying to catch up with myself and the prayers. God, please help me to wake up because I want to be tired. Like I need to get up. It's Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving, and I got things to do and I want to be tired, right? So I was going to do my coloring sheet for today, right now, but my eyes are not in agreement. So I think if I look in these four bags that I've been trying to you know, work with and show y'all what I have purchased over the last week, you know, because the bag's just sitting, they just sitting here just like this. And it's like, okay, well, what day, what day? I don't know. So when I went, I used that bag and then that bag over there. And then I went again to exchange something that I bought for one of those two bags and came back with those two bags. So one set has been here four days and now we're on the third day of this other set. Okay, so let's see. Wait, did I go Saturday? I did go Saturday. So Saturday, today is Wednesday. So Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, five days these two bags and then I went back Sunday after church four days these two bags and I've not opened them and unpacked them or anything because you know I just pulled out these little three stockings because I was showing them to my daughter and now I want to show them to you all okay so this is my paper box and I'm going to have to get another box I should have done that before I started this video because I'm gonna need to I got more I got more paper pads like this in that box and not in the box y'all see I'm tired in that bag so all right let's put this why you get in my chair why you can't why you can't get on one of your pillows over there he he always want to be getting in my chair can can I get in that chair right there boo boo can I get in that chair? Oh, he don't want me to get in that chair. So, um, I'm not sure what they're going to pick up um, for the still. Y'all know I'm always saying that. So, I have to find something creative quickly to put on the table because I'm not sure what they're going to, you know, stop the video on. I hope it ain't this daggone, um, what you call it. Uh, that extension cord that is on the floor because that will be stupid, okay? So maybe they'll wait like good YouTube control people and say, let's find something that we can, you know what I'm saying, work with. So now I'm going to leave this right here. Hopefully, you know, we can't see all three of them right now, but I'm trying to make sure all three are in the picture. Okay. Oh, that looks like Christmas stockings. That's what it is. So now we're going to talk a little louder so we can bring a bag over at a time. Bring all of them. Set them right there. And then we'll be able to look and see. Okay, that's bag one. Bag two. We got to get two more bags. Okay. Oh, I'm not going to do this all in one video. This is going to be part one. Part two could happen today. I'm not sure because I still have to do my coloring page and I have to upload all of them. And uploading all of these is a process. I'm already uploading right now as I'm videoing this. I have my children's footage being uploaded as we speak. So... Um, that's what's happening and I'm yet grabbing the four bags. Do you hear my tambourine? That's because I took that thing to church and not my Bible bag with it. And so when I went to 
the thrift store to make my exchange i had my tambourine with me and that's what you heard jingling like you know here it is so i just took that out of the bag and now i have the bags okay the bags are here near me and I got these three stockings because y'all my stockings are in the basement and I said I wasn't going to go through all of the Christmas stuff because I don't feel like it. So I have two Christmas boxes up here that I used last year and they are in my dining room but I couldn't resist these stockings when I saw them because I like this velour type and I have some stockings already. But I found all three colors and I was happy and they all are $1.99. The only thing is this has a hanging hook and the red one has a hanging hook. Oh, I couldn't find this green one. I kept saying the green one don't have one. How am I going to make one like that? Oh, good, 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 good. I didn't see that. I kept digging for it and digging. I was like, well, it's something over here. See how I'm waking up now? My eyes are still sleepy, but I am waking up because, um, you know, it's Christmas stuff. And this gets me happy and excited, like junk journal stuff, okay? So that's what this is, okay? Okay, so now we keep this right here until we pull up the next thing. I also got these mini bulbs. I got these mini bulbs. These were a dollar somewhere. I'm not sure where. Maybe at the Family Dollar or Dollar General or somewhere. But they sold them for 99 cents. So I bought all the ones I saw. The first one I saw, the lid was kind of off. And when I went to pick it up, it fell out my hand. They fell, you know, all this level fell off on the floor. And two of these. And one of these broke. I was like, oh, they're glass? I didn't know they were glass. But I don't think it's glass. I think it's a hard plastic. But the way it shattered on the floor and it wasn't that far from the floor, I was like, that's a whole problem. So they had four. And I sat it on, a, on the, um, not the counter, but on the shelf in a little thingy that was sitting there. I just kind of set it in there. And when I went back to look for it, I said, it'll just be missing one, but I can still get all four of them. And guess what? It was gone. Somebody bought it. So I said, okay, well, we got three brand new ones, and that's something that we got. Okay, now, that came out of the red bag. So all this came out the red bag, which was the second um, trip to the store. So I'm not going to do red bags yet. I'm going to do the first bags, okay? But since that was poking out at me, I just went with that, okay? So now, I'm going to move these on off to the side move these on off to the side and then I'm going to pull up this right here and put it on my table but I'm not going to show you yet we're going to look at we're going to look at these books here okay these are some big map books Idaho and California okay that's what I got and I got these books. And I got this book. And I got this book. Okay. This stuff is for junk journaling. I also got this bag. This bag was there for $1.49, which is way less expensive than you can find at a store. Unless you're at the Dollar Tree and sometimes you can't find the big ones. I got some old books. Maybe somebody's read them before. You know, Mark Twain. I never um, read a Mark Twain story or book or whatever. But I know when I was in college, they used to have things for your typing exercises. What Mark Twain said or something like that. Quotes by him. But I got this book. Hold on. Let's see what we got that I want to pull up here also. Okay. Because this is the first run to the store. And I didn't go to the store for this at all. When I went on this particular day, I was getting two cups for my grandson. I talked about this in a video before. I was getting two cups. And I was getting a pair of work boots for my, for my son. And I was getting 
um, one one big bath towel. I needed one big bath towel. And so um, I was just getting four items. Two cups, one pair of work boots, and one big bath towel. Okay? That's what I was looking for. And I left out of there with all these things like this. I was looking and I was saying, okay, why we have all of this? Now, what I might need to do is switch my tripod because we're not going to be able to see everything with this desk tripod. So, let me get up and get this other tripod because then I can put it up in the air. This one can go up there too, but it's acting a little funky and I don't like it because it wants to be swiveling out and falling about. And I can just put it on a stable situation. So that's where we at. We're going to try to just, you know, put it on this other tripod. And hopefully it will, you know, just comply. And we're going to try to do that without ending our video, okay? Because sometimes these um, things happen in a way that it be like, Oh, man, I mean to do that. Now I got to start all over, you know. So I'm trying. I'm standing up with it because I really mean not to end the video. It's so easy to happen. It's like, oh, my God, I didn't mean to do that. So here we go. Now, do you see how that is angled off better? That's right. And this, you know, away from the desk. And now I have to unleash uh, it a little bit so I can raise the stick up so it can be up higher so we can see all the things on the table. Okay. Did you see how that happened? Okay. That's exactly what I want. And then this tripod, see, is attached and it's a gooseneck. So I have to string it all up like this and everything. Now, I'm not sure why. It's like, why are all these tripods acting like this? And so this, you know, you can do something with it and get it to, you know, expand, you know, and come all the way up here and move all over here and everywhere like that. But now when I put my phone on it, it want to be doing this. So I put a little piece of paper down in there so that it can stay. And I probably have to put a piece of paper down in there. Because, listen, they tell you these things, you know, and then when you buy it, it lasts for the time that it lasts. And then it doesn't work right the way you need it to be working after that. So now that we have that together, hopefully the cats won't come uh, banging against the tripod, okay? So, that's my big bath towel that I wanted to get. And it's navy blue, but I have all things in there. I don't want to show you yet. I'm going to show you, but not just yet, okay? So, now, <clears throat> excuse me. So, we are pulling out still, okay? I know right here you can see everything. Let's put this little thingy on here again. Um, you can see everything right here because I was standing up and I saw you seeing everything. So if I stay right here, you're going to be able to see. <clears throat> Let me move my wallet because it's sitting here and I need to have all this space. Okay. And now let's see if we go over some. We are out of view. So I need to stay right here. Wish I had my blue tape, but I don't have my blue tape. So my son took that out the door. Okay. My mother, you got some blue tape? Yeah, I thought it was going to use some. Okay. I'm mark this right here so I can make sure. Because I'm going to be sitting down and I don't want, you know, things to get, you know what I'm saying, out of view for you. All right, so now by that little masking tape is all I'm using, okay? Let's see. Can you see my scissors there? You can. Can you see right there? No. So I need to stay right here. Don't go past that tape. How about the blue? We can see all the way right here. So we're not going to move that. So all within this range right here, you can see. 
and that's good all right so that's what i like just make sure while i'm sitting down that you can see everything that i need you to be looking at okay next all right put my scissors back up here okay now i'm not finished pulling out of the first bag okay i said i need one towel one big one i got two big ones okay it's all right people wash these and send them to the thrift store and this was four dollars and 49 cents in walmart you get a towel like this when they put in the beach stuff out they cost 13 dollars and some change okay and so we got some big bath towels okay somebody might feel like oh and it's okay you feel like oh if they washed it and sent it i'm gonna wash it again before it's used and it's gonna be fine okay so it's no different if i visited my cousin's house and took a shower there if i didn't pack a bath towel i should hope i don't have to bring a bath towel that you have an extra one but you know i don't visit people that that situation is not you know what i'm saying like that so <clears throat> not for overnight purposes now got that got these okay all right let's keep digging in the bag and we have these <clears throat> all right i know somebody is wondering why you keep buying this stuff and you're not making none of this journal stuff well i'm buying it because I need it and I want to have all I can have. So when I start, got this book too. Got this book, Savoring the Supremacy of God in All of Life. 140 Meditations. Now, I didn't read all of that. I just saw Taste and See and the price was right under $3. And I was like, oh, okay. Oh, look at this. Oh, somebody got a card in there. Oh. Oh, thank you so much for being a part of our wedding, for putting up with me for the past year. I appreciate your great patience. I'm sorry I've not seen you much lately, but we'll catch up later this year. Thanks so much. Love, Leah. Okay. From 2006. Okay. This says Heather. She wrote Heather. Okay. Now, this is what you call ephemera because, you know, I always thank God for you. This is ephemera because somebody wrote this for somebody for a wedding and they have it in this book. So maybe the book belonged to Heather and she sent it on out to the thrift store. And I'm thinking, <clears throat> I didn't read any of this. I just read that and this and the price was right. I knew it was a God type of book because, you know, that's Jesus presenting the bread to the disciples. And you know what I mean? He being the bread of life. He's giving them bread, break this bread and eat with me. You know, that kind of thing. But now I only bought the books. Okay. I bought these books for book pages. That's what I needed. I need more book pages because the books that I have are thesaurus, dictionary, and um, I think one, one book that's made like this. And I've been using the pages to make stuff out the same book. And I really like this one because when I opened it, it had a vintage map in it. But I need these book pages. That's what I bought it for. And so, um, you know, some are yellow, some are tan. <clears throat> and this one is larger. And I was like, yeah, I need this. And it's kind of like, you know, a poem or something. But it might not be a poem like this kind of thing. So this is a scripture, okay? All right, so... Um, I might not be tearing this book up, but I still might because, you know, people need the word of God and I might just use it as tuck spots and put this in there, you know, a page and then they get to read it. So, you know, we'll see. Then these are the kinds of covers that I want to use for my journals. So that means that this is all glued together. So I would just straight cut that off and this one off. And just let this stay on the spine while I use the pages. And then I would create one with a piece of cardboard and some washi tape. Okay, because I know how to do something. I just got to work on it so I can perfect it. Okay. All right. So we got this. All right. Now, here we go. Now, we got this second bag from the first trip. 
we're getting all the stuff out so we can look at it all at once. Now this one, this one was a real big book. And I was like, this is thousands of pages looks like, okay? It's a real big one. It says, a major motion picture, Andrew Hodges, Alan Tur Turing, the Enigma. Alan Turing, the Enigma, okay? I don't really know what it's about or if anybody know anything about it, but it's just like rated PG, like it's a real movie, you know, and this is the pages. It says something about the Nazis, okay, World War Two. Okay, I don't know. Oh, Kira Knightley plays in this. She played in the movie. Kira Knightley, she plays in um, Pride, and Prejud Pride and Prejudice with Matthew, what's his name? Matthew Henson, I think, or something like that. Yeah, okay, but I'm not getting ready to read this book. We're using this for pages, okay? That's what we're doing with this. We're using it for pages and everything like that. So I don't know. You two might use anything for a still, okay? But this is what I got this book for. Alan Turing, The Enigma. Okay, so I just glanced through the book a little bit and try not to find, I mean, try to see, do I see things that have bad language in it? That's all I do. Just skim through and see that because... When you tear the pages out, you just kind of inspect the pages real quick as best you can without reading. All right, put that down. Okay, put that down, honey. I got this thingy right here. We'll talk about it. You know, somebody don't know what I'm doing with it, but I got this thingy. Okay, it came in this like this. Okay, this will be a nice one for YouTube to pick up. Okay, pick that up for me. All right. Okay, so we put that right there, and I got this thing right here, too. I found all these rubber bands laying around on the floor as I was pushing my cart. I said, oh, I need these rubber bands. So I got this little basket, this little cute basket. Had some pine cones in it, okay, $3.49, okay? Everything I got was 20% uh, off. I always have 20% off because... I always make a donation. When I go, I carry something. I'm going to get a 20% coupon, and then I buy what I'm buying. So that's what that is. And here's more things. Okay, and another book, Her Mother's Daughter, a page turner with heart. Okay, I don't even know. My mother might want to read this. The author of The Woman's Room or The Women's Room. Okay, I'm not sure. My mother might like to read this. I can't even see what it's about. Let me see if I can see. I'm trying to see what it's about a little bit. I might get past it to my mother and let her read it. She likes to read books. Even though she's a Danielle Steele and a... Uh, what's that man name that she follow? Mm, I can see his name just as clear. Uh... She loved Danielle still. And what's this man name? I forgot. I can't think of it right now. Anyway, a rich and compelling story about four generations of magnificent women. Her mother's daughter celebrates the love, pride, sacrifice, devotion, and unheralded triumph of all women's lives. Oh, okay. All women's lives. Okay. In France, Belle, Anastasia, and Arden, Marilyn French has realized a stunning family by turns inspiring and touching unique and haughtingly heart, familiar her mother's daughter speaks eloquently to all parents and the children who love them and want to know them as they know themselves superb storytelling eloquent admirable okay brilliant and graceful okay this is people's understanding of, you know, women or whatever. So this should kind of work pretty good for my journals, okay? That's what that's going to be for. Page turn. My mother might like it, but I don't know if she do or not. Still thinking about that man's name. Um, Christmas cards. More paper. I've been trying to get in this. 
So I saw this little teeny tree and I absolutely loved it. I absolutely loved it. So now I was on this hunt for all of these kinds of little trees. And when I went back on Sunday, I found a couple more. So I'm going to be showing them, I guess, in a minute. So, yeah. So that's what we're doing with that. But I still got this paper that I'm trying to pull out. Okay. It's like, why you buy all this stuff? And I told myself, and I was so mad, y'all. Can I say I was so mad? I was so mad because this bag was so heavy. My fingers was burning. My fingers was burning and hurting so bad by the time I got home because I had to travel by bus. And I wasn't leaving any of these pads at this price. And God had all of them there while I was looking at all this other stuff that I wasn't going to buy because I'm not, you know, into that particular kind of thing to that magnitude of planning. It was all for planners. And I was like, oh, no. So this tag came off or something. But I need these tags because that's what we do in the junk world. Okay. I said, OMG, honey, my hand was hurting so bad, both of them. I was so mad when I got home. My fingers was hurting so bad, so bad that my pinky on the side, like over here, it felt on this one. It felt like I had a blister. Wait, let me see. On this one, because it's still sore right here. Baby, I said, it felt like I had a water blister. I was so mad. I was holding them bags like this, carrying them, and my fingers was just like this. When I put the bags down, my fingers was still like this because it's like, oh, my God, and my hands was hurting so bad. They hurt for, like, all the rest of the day on Sunday. And I was, um, not Sunday, Saturday when I went. I was so mad, and then I had a nerve to come out of the thrift store with two more bags on Sunday. But they was not heavy at all. They was very light. I was like, oh, what we not get ready to do is carry something heavy out here again today. Our hands are just recovering. Okay. I thought I'd share that with y'all because that was a moment of serious intenseness. I was very, 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 very mad about that. But I couldn't do nothing because I wanted to have it. And I knew it was heavy because these, these books heavy by themselves. And I got all of this. I carried all of this in two bags. I was like, oh my God. That's where I was with it. So we are yet um, just getting some stuff out the bottom of the bag and everything. That's what I'm trying to do. Just get my little stuff out the bottom of the bag. And I know y'all waiting for me and everything. And I'm coming. I'm just saying that these trees and baskets and stuff were in here and all kinds of little trash was in the bag so I just wanted to dump it out in my little box that I have right by my table while I'm crafting so I can move these two bags and be able to put the stuff back in it as I'm showing you and talking about it okay so we added this man I pushed that let me see if it's okay all right so now Okay, so these are here. I just dropped them over there. And I got all kinds of receipts and things. Every time I go, I just leave the receipt in the bag. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Okay, so now we have this Four Seasons stack, okay? Y'all know I like to go through all of the pages, but I won't. Now, this is, you know, a page that they already cut. But how lovely is this, man? This is so lovely. And I'm going to take this one out because I'm going to cut that up. And look at this. This is beautiful. And yes, you can feel the imprint of these little emblems. The bird is not where you can feel that. But, oh my God, y'all. Okay, did this say this was all birds? It's like birds and floral, okay? I guess that's what we're dealing with. All right. Okay, I know somebody like to see my paper. So, you know, I just, because I got good views on these kinds of videos. I mean, 51 is not as, is not as many as 511, okay? But it's better than five. 
And it's better than six, okay? And it's definitely better than one. But you can feel all this. All this is textured paper. This is all textured. It's like, this is going to be so lovely in my journals. This is not, this is flat. So I could cut this and make these, you know, belly bands. All of these could be belly band pages right here. And this is a nice belly band. You know, then just use this for the rest. And just see, this is what I'm going to be doing with this stuff. Because now I don't have to create this stuff, all of it. And this is so lovely. Who is at my door? It must be my son. Hold on. Hold on, y'all. Who is it? Who is it? Because you ain't saying. That's my son, y'all. He don't know I'm doing a video. Oh, my God. And he outside calling me. He like, why you open the door, ma? Why you open the door? You don't open the door when nobody don't say nothing. He absolutely right. But first thing is, before he knocked on my door, before he knocked on my door, I was... Hearing someone talk that sound like they were by my window and I was like, okay, somebody might be walking past Then all of a sudden then I heard a knock like dit, dit, dit. And I was like, I don't think I heard it, but then I think I did and um, And I was like, okay, maybe I heard somebody knocking on the door Maybe I didn't and then they knocked again. I was like, oh my god who knocking on my door and it was my son. Then he like, why you open the door? You ain't got no business opening the door. They ain't even say nothing. And he's right. You don't open the door. And I generally don't. But I figured it was my son. And it was. Y'all, y'all see me rubbing this paper? I'm rubbing this because this is so lovely. And I feel so good and great about this because I have to make all of this stuff, right? I've been making stuff out of... Um, regular copy paper and making stuff out of book pages and i've been doing it because you can make your own things for these junk journals but at the same time i didn't have the money to buy this stuff and i know somebody might be saying you keep saying in every video you don't have no money but y'all when i tell you if you have you know say you have a stash of 500 dollars that you've been holding and you have been so you know, skillful and wise in how you've held on to your money. Then other monies come, monies, other monies come into your hand and you put that aside because you don't have a particular need for it, right? So then when things come up that you can use some of the money for, and you got a coupon at the thrift store and you go to the thrift store for this pack of paper that you didn't expect was going to be there. But you just happen to always check this, you know, the section for this kind of stuff, craft section. And you walk into it and they're selling this for a dollar and ninety nine cent. All of this paper for a dollar and ninety nine cent and it's all textured. You just stop and you look at all of it and you put it all in your cart while you're looking at it. In fact, you put it in there first and then you look at it, you know, what you can while you can. You know what I'm saying? That's how that be happening. And then my son just walked in here and gave me some money. How much money he gave me? Let me see. He gave me $200. See that? Just like that. Out that. Out like that. He just like, here, man. And he gave it to me. I'm looking at it. He put some money in my account. He zelled it to me. He like, here, $200. See, that's what I'm saying. Because, you know, he needed something one time and I didn't give him that amount. But that's how much he gave me back. Hey, hey, hey. Now, am I going to buy something else? I'm not going to buy nothing else because I don't need nothing else. Like, I went to the thrift store to get him a pair of work boots and two big bath towels and my grandson two cups. And God had all of this there for me. <laughs> I was like, okay. And this bill, before I even go any further, this bill came to $42 after my tax. I mean, after my um, discount of 20% with my tax, $42. I got all of this stuff on this table right here with these towels. Can y'all see it? Am I leaning it? Let me get up. Let me get up. Okay. Y'all can't see. 
So I got all of these books that y'all see me put on there, right? And that Christmas stuff, those two, three pieces, and this towel, and this towel, and that Christmas bag, and everything that's inside of this towel. $42, okay? Now, that's called wisdom. This ain't called spending a whole bunch of money that you don't have. This is called wisdom, okay? And so, let's just look at this paper again. Okay. Oh, I opened right back to it, okay? I know y'all want me to hurry up and stop talking, okay? I'm going to hurry up. Butterflies. Oh, yes. This is not, but the butterflies are. Oh, my God. Okay. No. No. Nothing on this page. Okay. All right. Look at this. Y'all know I'm going to cut this up. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe I might cut these out because they texture and I can. Oh, yes. I'm going to cut these out. We're not going to rip them out. Calm down. Nothing. This is look like some kind of kitchen wallpaper. Okay. This butterfly, yes. These um, dandelions. Is it dandelions? What are they? Yellow flowers. Okay, I don't know. But with they, yep, they got some texture. Okay. No. I said I ain't going to show y'all all the pages. I know somebody want to see all my papers, though. Listen. Yes. Yes. No. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm just saying. I knew I was going to wake up if I opened this. Now, am I going to cut all these shells out? I might do one page. This is the kind of stuff I'll be doing. I might do one page of cutting this out because it'd be a lot like them stamps. And then if I do it, then I'll be like, girl, just cut the other page, honey. Right. No, no. See, this is what junk journaling pages look like. It looked like all of these scraps and all this stuff and some florals thrown on there and something that was cut out of another book and a sticker piece of text paper and some kind of you know, texture paper, something regularly. This is an exact um, depiction of a junk journaling spot. Okay, that's what that would look like. And this, okay, all of these, which was this one right here, they already cut one up, okay? So you know I'm going to cut that. Okay, yes, texture, yes. But I got a couple texture packs, y'all. Nope, but this is nice. It's fall, but it looks Christmassy. I might use that in my Christmas um, work. Now, I don't do um, Halloween or nothing like that, but he looks like my spoon, my little dark-skinned fellow here, okay? But he's cute. This is a cute little jack-o'-lantern, all right? But this is very cute paper. I like it. Oh, now this one I might not use at all. So, you know, this might become, you know, I might put these back to back, you know. I like the owls, so I might cut it out and just take all the owls out and the birds and the cats. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to cut that out. So let's take these out because I won't be using these for anything else. I mean, the cat is cute with the um, sticking up the pumpkin head. He is cute, but... Um, the page is just, you know, it's a Halloween page and I don't do Halloween. So we're going to take that out. No texture on this page. This is just like a ledger and notebook paper for a writing spot. And all of this is just like junk journaling. What does this say? Not what we say about our blessings, but how we use them is the true measure of our Thanksgiving. Okay, this is textured, this corn, just the corn and the pumpkins. Okay, oh, beautiful Christmas paper. Oh, beautiful. How many of them? One, they used one. Did they use one? They did, they used one. I only see one of them. I'm trying to peel it because I want two of them to be here, but it's not. So they used one of them from right here. Okay, and then two of these are here. Beautiful, beautiful texture, no texture. All right, and this says the four seasons. I saw this when I was at um, Hobby Lobby. I saw this pack there, but I ain't buy it because I said I don't need that. All right, and now look, and I ain't get it. It would have been nineteen dollars because their big packs was 
$19, but it had a whole lot of papers in it, the ones that I bought. So I don't know how much that was, but my big one was 19 whatever it was. And this one is Spring Feast. Oh, let's turn it this way. Spring Feast. It looks like it will open up from the way I was doing it, but it's an open book. Oh, all texture. All texture, y'all. All texture. Three of each, I guess. All texture. I was so happy when I saw this. I was like, yes. All texture. Feels so good. Ugh. Oh, my goodness. So nice. So nice. So nice. Okay, don't rub them all. Just go fast. Let them see. Fast. Okay, fast. All right. This one is hanging out. Okay. Let's put it right there. All right. This is no texture. No texture. But these tags. So I got to cut all these out. Okay. Oh, it's three pages of them. I got to cut them out. They won't be so hard to cut, though. They'll be easy. Let's do one at a time. Oh, y'all know I do this every time. Oh, this is nice backing paper, too. And somebody would use it for that. They would use this because this is nice. Like, this is what they call uh, color dye, like tea dye or whatever. But I won't be using that. I'm going to be cutting them tags out so I don't have to make none. Okay, no texture on these. No texture. Oh, that's so pretty. That, isn't that pretty? That's so pretty. That's the same pink. Well, a little bit lighter. Okay. Really pretty. I like it. Then we got this. That's so nice. Now, see that? You got this one. That's what you call double-sided paper. Oh. Let me see it. Do it say double-sided? It says... I don't see it. I don't see it say double-sided. Oh, yeah, it does. It says half double-sided. Half of them. Okay? All right. Half of them. So we're in the half of double sides. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Very nice. This one, y'all, when I say, do this look like some kind of velour felt? It is. I was like, oh, my. I ain't show y'all the price. This pack was $2.99 for this. Okay? $2.99. This one, black and white, $2.99. Can y'all see that? $2.99. And all of this is this kind of felt stuff like this. I don't know if I would have bought this if I was in the store to buy it. This is not one of those pages. This is just plain, real thick cardstock. This is not one. This is not one. But this is. This is. This feel like old-timey wallpaper. That's what that is, okay? This is not one. That's not one. This is not. This is. This is. I said, oh, I'm definitely getting this. Let's see. And this is not one. All right. And let's see. Okay, so this goes here with that, okay? All right. This is not one. Those are not. That's not. That's not. That's not. That's not. And the solid black is not. $2.99. Okay. All right. We got that. This one was $2.99. These are brand new. You know, people didn't use a lot of this stuff. They didn't use it. This is textured in some way. It's like foil. This is what they call foil. So, you know, let me see if y'all can see it. Let me see. Are you seeing it? Yes, you're seeing it. Okay. That's foil. Okay. Beautiful, right? Look at that. That's foil. Yes. And this is textured. Wow. Golly. And this is like that black and white. Yep. Textured. This stuff is amazing. $2.99. And 20% off. 
who leaves this there? I don't. Let me see. All right, we'll have to see every page, right? Okay, look at that. That's silver. It's very nice. Okay? Okay, we'll have to see every page. Now, this looks like something you would want to color. Okay? Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. That is so pretty. Oh, my God. That's so beautiful. Oh, this is textured. This feels like the black and white stuff, the green. The black is plain, okay? It's plain paper. And this is textured like, uh, like, um, uh, I don't want to say plastic, but I was going to say like sticker, like somebody put a sticker on the paper, you know? Maybe you call them vellum, I don't know. But, and this is all like that black and white stuff felt. Uh, and this one. Okay. Looking good, right, y'all? Yes, looking good. I can't wait to start my journals. I got this job coming up next week. Oh, look at that. Oh, boy, look at that. Oh, my. Can y'all see that? That looked like a sheet of aluminum foil almost, you know? Oh, this is serious right here. That's very nice. And you can see this texture paper, so, you know, you won't even have to use the other side if you don't want to. You can just flatten this down, glue this part down, and just use this. See, that's what you do with some of it like that so that you can have this kind of texture imprint. This is something to look at right here, though. Golly. And I'm glad there's only one of them. I mean, it's nice, but it's hard to look at for me, okay? All right. Moving along. Okay. I said we're not going to look at all the papers, but somebody is in the background saying, I want to see all the papers. And I said, okay, calm, calm down. Everything's all right. We can look through it. The ones who don't want to watch won't watch. Okay. All right. That's where we at. Okay. I heard you. And it was two or three people at the same time. So I was like, calm down. I'm letting you see it. Now, this says specialty card stock. Specialty card stock. Okay. And this is that felt stuff. You can see it is because it's sticking to it. Okay. And somebody ripped that off because that's what we do. Rip pages. Okay. And put them in some kind of tuck. And this is foil. That's pretty. I can use that for Christmas. It might look orange, but you know, I might use this for Christmas. You know. I'm going to take one of these out because I need that for my Christmas project. Okay? When I see stuff, you know, I'll be thinking about it while I'm going. Some of this is raised a little bit. It looked like sticker. Like sticker on there. Okay? Alright. I'm not going to cut all of these. So I don't feel like it. Okay. Oh, look at that. I knew that was a type of orange. Just like that gray thing okay all right look at that that's pretty that's pretty it's nice to see those are in there okay all right all right all right oh this is you know you can feel it doesn't this look like christmas Somebody might say no, but to me it did. Oh, that's why they had to rip at the top because they didn't understand how to get this out. Like I don't understand, okay? All right, so let's try. We're going to try to turn it this way and open up the spine backwards, okay? It don't matter if you break the spine. I'm sorry, y'all. I ain't mean putting it all the way up there, but... You know, they didn't think about how we're going to get the pages out. So, that's okay. We worked it it's out. Okay. Now, moving along. Okay. Now, look at this. This is like a big writing spot page. Okay? All right. That's that. I'll put this one back in here, I think. Might add that to the Christmas thing. All right. There you go. Now, we got a little one. We got a little one with all kinds of things like this. It's a good day. Okay. All kinds of words. Enjoy the journey. 
Okay. All right. I ain't sure how much this one cost. I don't know if I did or not. This one was a dollar ninety nine cent for this one. A dollar ninety nine. Okay. And we got this. And I'm there so often they let me have a couple of these things. They just like, just take that. Just just have that. <laughs> just put it in there. That's what they do. You know, the manager. I know these people. I'm there frequently. They be saying, see you soon. I be like, I was just here yesterday. $149 for this book. Okay. You see what it said cost? $5.99 somewhere, $9.99 somewhere else. And this was $149. Okay. Okay. Then here's another one. Somebody got it on sale for three oh five. It would have been eight ninety nine. They got it for three oh five. I got it for one forty nine. Okay, that's how we're doing. It says tattered and worn. That's this series of paper, tattered and worn. Okay. Um, all right. Okay. That's that. Not that many pages in there, but it's okay. We can use it. 149 again. All right. Okay. That's a nice one. Okay, some of these pages I have stuff that looks similar to it, but you can never have enough paper because you'll know what you want to create, you know, in your pages, in your books, how you want to, you know, decorate it and put things in place for it. You don't know how you want to do any of that. That's pretty paper. And then here's another one that says somebody got it on clearance for $3.97. We don't know how much it probably would have cost. I got it for $1.49. Okay, this says tattered time also. So this is all about time, I guess. Tattered time. Okay. Okay. Wheels and the things that go inside of a clock. This is cool. Wait, that's three. Okay. Music pages. Dice. Okay. Uh, oh, tickets. Tickets, baby. Tickets. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. Some of y'all so good. Y'all like tear it out. <laughs> y'all already know I got to cut. This is why I can't be doing shorts because I got all this work to do like this. This cutting stuff is serious. Okay. What's this like an old, a old um, typewriter? That's what it looks like an old typewriter. Okay, and an old clock of some sort. Yep, old clock pieces. This looks like an old sewing machine type of thing. All oh, this is nice. Okay, you said tear it out. I am tearing it out. You gotta give me a minute. Right, because this is, you know, tags and, you know, journaling spots. You don't just put that like that in there. This is a journaling spot, too. So take it out. Okay. <laughs> I need all this stuff. And this, too. This is more cutting. All this stuff means i got to cut it. This part's of a typewriter. Okay. Look at that. Nice. Okay. This is very nice stuff, okay? Oh, look at that. Tape measure. Tape measure. You can't put this in one place like this. I mean, you could, but why? Like Payless used to say, you could pay more, but why? Right. Then just tear that and just cut that in strips, okay? It's coming apart now. So right here's another one, Country Road, eight ninety nine. I got it for $1.49. All right, y'all. Y'all got to hold on for a minute because I need to take my food out of the oven. I'm coming right back with my food. Hold on. Hold on.
coming. Ants are coming. Ants are coming. Y'all know I can't end the video and start again because, you know, if I end the video and start again, you know, it's just a problem. And I went and got my food and it was warm because it came out the, fro out the freezer and it was frozen. It's chicken tenders and french fries and it was frozen and it's warm but it's not hot the way I want it. So I washed my hands and everything because I was bringing it in here and when I felt it out of the foil it wasn't even hot enough. So I already turned the oven off. I just said let it set in the heat for about 15 more minutes it'll be fine. Okay, good. Now, Country Road. Okay, y'all. I think we have one similar to this. I ain't sure. But um, I thought I saw this kind of paper before. I do have some paper like this. But I don't know if it had the flowers on it. I can't remember. Okay, but this is all nice. And this is very thin paper. This is not cardstock. This is regular like copy paper. I do have a pad that has... This kind of old wood look to it. It's not the same paper because I know I don't have this. Okay. All right. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. That's pretty. Oh, it's several pages of that. Okay. Oh, they got several pages. Did I see all of that in these? Wait a minute. Let's check it out. What does it say on the front? 130 sheets, 20 designs, 6 pages each. Okay. All right, okay. All right, this is kind of cool. All right. Look at that. That's definitely old brick. And it's a lady right in there. Some stores, some more people right there. That's pretty cool. That's what, you know what I'm saying. It's really cool. Okay. All right. Butterflies. Butterflies. Okay, all right, let's see what we got. Oh, this text behind there, that's nice. This is what they call layers and stuff like that. This is pretty. What's this, gold dots and white dots? And that pink, that's pretty. Okay, look at that, that's nice. All right, that's the end of that book. And that was 149 okay? Then I got this sticker, Live Today Fully. When it says, Live Today Fully and you'll create a lifetime of meaningful memories. Then it says, Blessings, bright, blessings brighten when we count them. Time flies when you are having fun. Take pride in how far you have come and have faith in how far you can go. Go for it. Then something's missing here. Always remember you are unique. Enjoy the moments that make you smile. It's the journey, not the destination. To the world, you may be one person, but let's see. Maybe, maybe, just maybe. We can open it. Let's see. Can we get it out? Okay. It said, to the world, you may be one person, but but to one person, you may be the world. Follow your heart. Enjoy life. Live well, laugh often, love much. Believe. This is nice. And I got it for how much? 69 cents. You know it wasn't 69 cents in the store. They would have charged two forty nine. We don't know how much they paid for it, but I got it for seventy cents, less a penny, plus twenty percent off. Okay. All right. We can't get it back in right now. It's okay. Put it to the side. All right. And then we got these poinsettias, right? Very pretty. Ninety nine cent. They only use one thing from right here, and we set that off to the Christmas side. Now, I just bought a pack of paper from the thrift store. And then I bought another pack of paper from the thrift store. And that second pack that I bought is real thin. It almost looks like trace, um, yeah, like tracing paper. But it said, um, it said it was copy paper. It was in a pack, but it wasn't like this. So, anyway, when I see the paper, I buy it because 
$2.99 versus 8 bucks, like seven eighty three for a ream of paper. And I don't know how many pieces they use. It don't even matter. $2.99. I buy this because I need paper and I got a coffee dye and stain and all things. And I need these kind of papers because it just adds some different, um, you know, text writing spots. And this was 79 cents. I got a blue one and I got a yellow one. Now I got a second yellow one. Okay. Then I saw this, which is holiday letterhead. This was a dollar and 49 cents for all of these. And they're red and white. And then there's some green ones back here. That's just green and gold. Okay. And so this one is whatever is left to it for a dollar and 49 cents. Okay. And then we got another garden party stack. I'm really not going to go through all of this. I know somebody wants me to. I hear you saying go through it. Please go through it. Please go through it. Textured. This is textured. This is textured. This green line is. That pink is. That's not. That's not. This is. And that green is. Okay. Golly. This is not. But these. All of these are. All oh, this is textured. Yes, I got to get me a box to just say texture paper because then I don't have to look through all of it to find that page was textured. This is not. All right, that's not. I said I'm not. This is textured and it's stained. Do you see the stain all the way around? Look like a water stain. When I first got the paper from the bundle pack, that I bought on um, what you call that place, Facebook Marketplace. And then she said, just buy it through um, Poshmark on my page on Poshmark. I saw that all this stuff was like water stained and damaged over here. And I was like, well, this whole pack is messed up, but it's okay because it's vintage. And what I learned was that when I bought some more stacks from somebody else on Facebook Marketplace, theirs was like that. And then I see this. So it's actually created that way. They got a lot of this stuff. I'm not going to be cutting all this stuff, I don't think. I'm not tearing it out because, you know, what you tear out means you got to cut. And I don't want to cut. Now, this is a whole situation. I don't know how I'm handling it. This looks like a paper doily on the edges. You know, all kinds of different things. All this is textured. Looks like a bunch of chandeliers or something. I don't really know. This is nice. See how somebody like ASMR? This is this is nice. It feels good. Here's a penny. Somebody might like that. I might do that on the short. Okay? I might do that on the short. Don't tell nobody. Okay? Oh, look at that. It's very nice. Both of those are textured. Oh, boy. Looking at all this stuff is so time-consuming, right? And I want to look at it. And somebody else, like me, want to look at it. they like, oh, I want to see it. I want to see your paper. Like this just like the other one. Don't do it on here, Joanne. Don't do it on here. All right, don't do it. Okay, I won't do it. All right, look. Okay. Look, all these things, they just telling me, you got to cut me out. You got to cut me out. And I'm like, I don't want to. <laughs> That's where I'm at. <laughs> oh, God, don't look at the butterflies. Don't look at the butterflies. But y'all already know that I'm going to tear this one out. Y'all already know it. Because, you know, I just can't leave this in here like this. I got to tear it real slow because I don't want to rip it. I got to cut all of them up. See, I got my work cut out for me, don't I? Yes, I do. I have my work cut out for me. No texture. Texture, yes. Okay? Okay. Are y'all seeing this? Okay. I hope y'all been seeing these. I don't know how I was flipping up or what was happening here. I think I need to move this back a little bit because it's down low. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry. Y'all saw the top, but y'all didn't see it all. I got to focus. I don't know if y'all even saw Country Road because maybe I was down here and y'all didn't see it. So let's just do a flip back. 
to the country road bag um pack because this is the last one i did before that just so y'all can you know kind of see what it was because i don't know if y'all saw it all because i was you know didn't realize i needed to move this back because the stack was up high you could see now it's down low and you can't see so i had to you know just go back a little bit for you and everything i hope that you saw it okay did we look at the price on this one? We didn't. This one was a dollar and ninety nine. These textured pages and non textured. Okay, dollar ninety nine. All right. Now we on this one. Yo, do y'all see how many packs it was so far? It's one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs of large paper, and then one, two three, four, five small ones, okay? Y'all know it was heavy. I told y'all it was burning my hands. This is all textured as you can see, right? So you want to use this whole spot, right? I'm going to cut this whole thing out, and I am, and use it in my journal. I sure am. I'm going to ink it and use it. Look how pretty that is. That's beautiful, okay? Look at this paper, God, that's so pretty. I only got a few pieces of glitter paper. That's beautiful. Oh, and it's double-sided, y'all hurting me. Because <laughs> I want to use both sides. Why y'all just could make this and make the back like that and then give me this page next? Golly, I hate when they do that. I hate that because this always makes it hard for what you're going to use and how you can use it. Look at that. And it's got the, you know what I'm saying, see this? Then I would have to hide these flowers, and I would, just to have that imprint. Oh, my God. Oh, so many things to cho choose from and decide on. Look at that. This just look like ink stamps, so I probably can live with that and use this one, because that's what I like. Oh, you never know though. It's so pretty and it makes it hard and difficult to decide what to do. It would have been better if they had a did like this. All this is texture, all this is not. So you can use this and cover it up and get some of that. Or, you know, you got to come together and play with the paper, as Pam says, at the paper outpost. Pam said, just have fun playing with the paper. And if you feel like you want to put it here, put it here. You want to put it there, put it there. No rules, no rules, and nobody can tell you how to decorate what you're creating. It's your creativity, and you can do it the way you want to do it. Oh, this is so beautiful. I love this book. God knows I love this book so much. Wow. Man, I love this book. I might set this to the side so until I do my own book, because I love this. I'm putting this over here with my stuff, because... I mean, I got to make my own journal, and I love that one. That That's like the best one I've seen. Like, I love every page of it. Last one. Oh, I show you the price on it. How much was it? $1.99. And this one had how many papers? Because this is a pretty thin book. Uh, 24 pages, double-sided. Okay? All right. And now this is the last one. This double-sided, too. With specialty finishes. Yeah, you can feel them. This this feel like it got wet, actually. I'm taking this off and use this in my journal. I am. Because it's, you know, it's just weathered kind of feel. And look. Okay, do I want to cut these things out? These look like something fun to cut out. Yeah. I'm going to cut them out. Okay. Because you need beautiful things to put in these in these pockets and things that you invent and create. This is nice too. But how would you cut this? You can't really cut it. You can tear it. Tearing might be better. I don't know. I might cut it. I might cut it. I might cut it. I might cut it. I don't know. I might cut it. I'm looking at it and thinking about it. Okay. Oh, this one like this. I don't like this one that much. Okay, I like the back of it, though. I like the back of it. Can y'all see the top and the bottom? I think you can. I think you can. 
Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that one. I don't like this one so much on this side, but I like that side. It's got a paisley print to it, and this is pretty too. You might can't see it that well. That's pretty too. Oh, um, this is another one to tear out to cut up. Oh, um, okay. All right. See, they have more than one purpose. You can do something. This is nice. I like the orange. I like that pink too. That's pretty. I might not use this. Just use that side. Mm -hmm. Not really. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. We're getting there. Okay. All right. This one is okay too. I like this. I like that. Oh, this is another one? Oh, see, we can save these. Maybe we'll cut them all out. I like this one, though. I might keep that pink because I might need that. What's on the back of this? That's a green. And this is that same green. But I wonder why they did... Oh, maybe that... I wasn't looking at pink. No? This is a whole different one. Okay, let's focus. Let me see something. Oh, yeah, that's green with pink. This is orange with pink. And then this one is green with green. Okay. Don't trip me out. I wonder why this is pink and this one is green yellow and then this one is yellow. I don't know what's happening. So maybe it's, you know. Okay. All right. Let's take this because this is a different one. Okay. All right. Okay. And then it's doubling up again, doing the same thing again. So some stay in the book, some get cut out. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. That's a pretty one. That look way better than the other one. What can I do with that? I ain't sure yet. Mm. All pink and then this. Okay. This be good for the AKA girls. Okay. They like that kind of stuff. Okay. All right. All right, so we're finished looking at that, and I got all of these cutouts. Oh, boy. I said I got my work cut out for me, y'all. Y'all know I do. So I have all these things to get to cutting. All of this out of them. And here we go. Put all that together, because now this is another assignment okay we'll set that up there y'all saw this book and y'all saw the tom sawyer book and y'all saw that one right this is the drifters okay james that's the man named james somebody james baldwin i think james baldwin books is who my mother like and daniel still y'all saw that book and y'all saw this one okay so now we can move them off to the side this is envelopes. Why did I get the envelopes? They were 79 cents. I got them for the security side of the envelope because um, somebody that I follow used the inside of this. And she, you know, drew whatever kind of design, tore it all out, and then she fashioned a beautiful work out of all security envelopes that were blue and black. I think blue and black or blue and gray. And she fashioned something beautiful out of it. Now, um, so I got that. Now, this is a folk guitar music book. Okay? It don't matter what kind of music book it is. You just need music pages. And then this has the words to the songs also. So, I got this book for that purpose. So, I can have music pages beyond the ones that I bought. This was $3.99, okay? And the books, when I went to the thrift store on this day, this is the day that the lady gave me, I kept saying 20% off, but I'm reminded with the book right now while I'm explaining that the lady gave me a coupon for 50% off. It was 50% off at the top, 30% off in the middle, and 20% off at the bottom. I already had a 20% coupon, but her 50% portion, it applied to accessories, books, media, shoes, and household. And I said, oh, let me see if I can get my stuff with this book coupon. Because clearly this is a book 
But, you know, this, what they got on here? They got housewares. So, housewares in office. There was still housewares on there. So, but to me, this is a book of scrapbooking paper, right? It might be a pad, but it's scrap, scrapbook cardstock pack. Okay, so I asked and she was looking at me like, that's not a book. And I was like, it is a book. It's a scrapbook. But she let me get the 50% coupon, but the bill was only $42. So that's why I got the books. Because the lady gave me the coupons while I was looking at the planner. And I was like, I don't want to buy all these planners. And it was a whole lot of them, 19 of them. And I got this because this was just so cool. And say immediate media. And this was a dollar and ninety-nine. I just saw this and say luxury paper collection worth eight ninety-nine free. I don't really know where this came from, who got this, but I ain't never get it. But it's a card making. So maybe somebody that's into it and they always buy a lot of scrapbooking stuff. Who knows? And they sent it to them for free. But she sent it to the thrift store. So I'll be using this cover. I'm going to glue it right down and make it make it something. So that's one part. And this is another. I'm going to get this label off of here. And then for the shiny coat, I just learned today watching the video. When it's shiny like this, you just take a sanding block and just run it over it gently. And it'll take the sheen off. I was like, oh, and then you can ink it. Okay. And then all of this, this is good because all this tattered stuff, worn. Then you just see this book right here. Let me show you again. Maybe you missed it. Tattered time. Okay. So all of this goes with junk journaling. Yes. And she sent this to the thrift store and I snatched it right fast because I needed it. Look at this. They said this is free. But it's worth $8.99. So you're going to pay $9 for this. And somebody got it free. And they sent it to the thrift store for me. Because they know I don't know where to get it from. And I can't get it free. And I have to make this paper. And what is this? All kinds of aprons. This is fussy cutting. Sure it is. I have to take this out. Because this is fussy cutting. And I have to cut all of them because they're cute. And they're not stickers. But you can make them into stickers. Okay, all right. Okay, this is very nice. I'm so glad that I was at the thrift store on the day that I was there. Okay, I'm so glad. Don't rip it out, Joanne. It's okay because everything I be ripping, I'll be like, that's a Christmas page, and it is. But I gotta make something. I'm working on, I'm working on something. I shouldn't have torn it out, I should have taken the um. But that's right, I'll use that piece later. I should have taken the staples out of it. That's what I should have did. And I will take the staples out. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. What are these? Strawberries? That's very Christmassy. That's very Christmassy, and so is that. And this kitchen piece is lovely. Don't you think that's lovely? That's very nice. Somebody don't know what I'm talking about. Somebody... Somebody don't know what I'm talking about. Look at that. That's the same as this cover. Okay, this is beautiful. Yes. And I got it for a dollar and ninety-nine cents. Okay. Yes, I did. Then I got this Jeff Moore in the distance. This is a music book. But this was $2.99. I bought it because I need the music pages. And by the time I have all of these. Somebody said, what was that? Let me see. Okay. Okay. I don't know who none of these people are, what they're singing about or nothing. I just want the uh, music pages. Okay. Don't matter. Just, you know what I'm saying. And this was a fingerboard book. So this is a music book, but it's fingerboard. Okay. Somebody wrote something on here. And this one was a dollar and forty nine cents. Okay, and so the guy said, "Oh no, that's not music. It's fingerboard." I said, "It's perfect. I need this." See, somebody done wrote something in here. Okay, they was learning something. They know how to do something for themselves. Okay, 
And that makes it even the more interesting in your junk journal because somebody knows something, some kind of way about this. All right? Okay. There you go. I got that. That was a dollar and 49 cent, right? And then we're back to where we started, which was these maps. Okay. And they had two more, but the other two was for something. This was two ninety nine. And this one was two two ninety nine. This one is much thicker than this. Do you see? Okay. So this is a big one. This is a real big one. I don't know how much a book like this costs. Let's see. I don't see no price down here. Sometimes you can see one, but I don't see it on here. Oh, right here. It's up the top. $24.95. $25 for this. And for this one, $19.95. But I got it for these gorgeous maps. So I might cut that out the back. Mm -hmm. I might cut all of these off. And this. Cut it all off. Yep. And then you get these beautiful maps. I know don't nobody want to look at me making this stuff because I'm going to be cutting this up and tearing it up and ripping it up and everything like that. And that's what you in, put in your um in your journals. And they're like, why you want to rip it all up? Somebody could use that. They also can use GPS. <laughs> so, you know, you don't really know. Y'all saw me see this. I was like, oh, okay. So maybe I'm going to cut the middle one out. And it's okay because on both sides it will still be mapped. And what I don't and what I don't um, cut out of it, what I don't cut out, where's my, I put it up here, my oh, letter opener. See, I'm getting ready for this stuff. Y'all think I'm just talking about this all the time. No, I have all kinds of tools and gadgets and great things. And I have it up here in some kind of way. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. So my chair is bopping into it. So I'm just going to open this staple up right here and this one. Okay. Because I want this so I, while I'm cutting, doing my cut work, I can take this one out. Okay. That's what I'm doing. I don't want to rip it. Because it's already got the lines right there. That's what I was saying I should have done when I was ripping that red page out of that other book a moment ago. This is a letter opener. And you just open these staples. And then you can just leaf one page out. Lift it. There you go. And then when I cut all of these out according to the dark green line, then you get little little teeny tag spots and on the other side it'll still be all matte see that's that's smart okay that's stuff that i ain't got to buy from tmu again right now because i'm gonna have all of those little pieces and that's gonna be good so the rest of this i can rip up and rip out if i want to take it apart i will later but right now i just wanted to lift that up so i can you know what i'm saying do something for myself these don't have to be all pressed down perfectly. They just need to be back in. So that was the Idaho book. And then this one is California. And the maps are different, baby. This is how we had to go. Okay, somebody don't even know this. You had to, you know, you had to be like, I live right here. Right, yep, right here. And then I got to get to right here. So you got to come on out of here on Route 8, and you got to drive all the way until you get across here somewhere like this, and then you got to find some kind of throughway to come on through, or maybe a connected highway and come on around, and all through here, and that might take you, you know, two days, or it might take you four hours, could take you eight hours, could take you a train flight, I mean, a train flight, <laughs> a train trip, or an airline flight, you'll never know. Right, so there we go, a <laughs> train flight. Okay, that was even funny to me. Okay, so I'm just looking real quick through this to see if I see another one of those pages that I want to lift. But you can't lift this one out, so 
I just wanted to just thumb through it. This is a big, a big book, okay? And it was it was four of them all together. The other two was five dollars, so I left them right there. Okay? This is just so good. Just this is so good. This is so good, y'all. I love this stuff. Like this, I love this. Between this stuff with this junk journaling and the word of God, I'm just saying I have found my happy place. Okay? Christmas junk journaling and the word of God. I'm just in my happy place. I'm so serious. I wish I knew how to do something at home to make money where I can make, you know, just $500 a week. If I could just make $500 a week, four weeks, that's $2,000 in a month. I would be very, very, very happy with that. Okay. Cause I, I know how to live you know, in a way where $2,000 a month can do it for me. You know what I'm saying? And I just, you know, I just don't even know what I can do online digitally where I can just work a couple hours in the morning or whatever and have the rest of my day to myself and make money. That's what I want to do because I just want to sit right here at this table and make journals. And then I want to make them beautifully. And I want to put them on my website that I already have. I got a website. I want to put it on my website. And you can purchase it from me and not from Etsy. And I can make all the money myself. That's what I want to do. You know, I don't want to go to work outside of my house. But, you know, this is where I am. So I showed y'all this right here. Okay, it's like, God, uh, thank you for the job. The job is coming up. I'm about to start this job, I think. I think, okay? And there's some other things going on right now that I don't want to disclose. I'll wait and see what happens. But I'm praying about it. And I talked to my son about it. And I talked to my mother about it. Uh, my mother at my church about it. And, um, and I'm just like, you know. It's kind of, you know, sensitive for me right now. So I won't discuss it just now. But, um, yeah. So I got this. I love it. And this little one was the one that sparked it and everything. So, you know, this is what I'm going to be putting around my house with those little three stockings, all these little trees and baskets and great things like that. You know, do something with them. I'm not sure what I'm going to do, but I'm going to do something and it's going to be okay. And I'll show y'all when I get to it. So I know this video was a very long video. Let me get up and see how long. That was two bags. I've been waiting for a couple of days and I still want to go to bed. An hour and 28 minutes. So I've done what I could do with this. And um, I've shown you all where we are with it. And this is, you know, the stacked upness on the sideness. And that is fussy cutting over there. And those are all those books right there. And I just bought that juice in here. Oh, y'all said y'all did, I didn't open that up. Oh, I didn't. Oh my God, this gave me a two hour. <laughs> this gave me two hours if I open that. Let me try to do it real fast. I forgot. Somebody said you didn't open that. I'm telling you, it must be the leading of the Holy Spirit. Because if I if I hadn't got up to show y'all the whole table, I forgot all about opening that towel over there that I told y'all I'm not going to open yet. Okay, so let's hurry up because we can maybe be on two hours. We're not going to talk about it a whole long time. That's because we're going through all the paper. Looking at all the paper. Somebody said, I want to see the paper. I, I watch your videos all the way to the end. I was like, oh, okay. Okay, you watch it all the way to the end. Well, baby, since you watched it all the way to the end, we're going to look at the paper. Okay, now, I'm going to put this on the floor because my cat don't want to play with this. He likes to chase stuff like this around, and he liked this. So, I just got to fold it around. There's some kind of, you know, I ain't sure. Let me put it up there. I might need it for a minute. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, I got to get all this paper down first, y'all. If I don't get the paper down, I can't get to that. Okay? For it be a mighty avalanche happening up in here. Okay? Somebody won't know how to help me with this situation when it start rolling all over the floor in places. And it won't be pretty. Okay? I'm just trying to say it won't be pretty. Put all this stuff together in a stacked up kind of way. And get it out of the way so we can see what's in the rolled up towel. Okay? Because I almost forgot... 
In fact, I'm going to end this video and I'm going to come right back. And I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to come right back and I'm going to show y'all. Okay? I promise. I'm just going to end this one so it won't be two hours. And I'm going to go get my food out of the oven and I'm going to upload start this uploading and then i'm gonna start the next one okay so i'll be right back in a few minutes i promise